Hello, Cancer. Welcome. I'm Ryan. Thank you for being here. This is going to be a general reading for you to be dealing with. Of course, everything may not resonate, so take what does and leave the rest. And for more tarot readings after this, please check out my wife's channel, Prophecy Through Tarot, to read to you as well. Thank you. See what's going on. One more, I'll jump into this. All right. Yeah. All right. Interesting. The star. I'm going for the stars on top of the deck. But jumping into this cancer right away, what they show me, I kind of feel like that goes hand in hand with what they're doing energetically speaking for themselves. Um, they're wanting to take something up a notch. And the current situation or circumstances that they're in or dealing with right now, they have a lot to straighten out and handle. I kind of feel like this is all about management, business, um, responsibility to oversee how everything is moving forward for themselves because they're kind of giving me this energy of so much is going on. They can't be very, they can't be that specific as to everything that's going on within this. Um, they're just saying I need to kind of oversee and manage everything um and that's what they're in the process of doing and taking care of they're saying that they're putting everything back on track straightening some things out and even though it kind of feels like it's off to a shaky or rough start they're definitely getting a better handle and control on things that is for sure but at the same time um they're saying they're needing to deal with the situation the circumstances first before they can kind of focus on themselves um and that definitely makes sense it's kind of like saying you can't Hmm. let's just say for an example for a job or a career content niche you can't exactly give someone that responsibility unless they know how to do it um they know how to do it and they're having to kind of prove themselves and show that they know how to do it before they actually kind of step something up a notch and i kind of feel like once again that goes hand in hand with their their work their career their business whatever it is um but there's also this kind of double checking with themselves to make sure that even though things are being straightened out and put back on track, that it stays that way. For some reason, there's a consideration or contemplation here as to long-term vision um, down the line, or let's just say, quote, end game, um, even though, you know, it's just down the line, long-term. Um, once again, they're showing me this energy of kind of exuding so much confidence, but they're also very grounded with how they approach this and work on things. And so they're saying that they need to kind of come up with some sort of new plan or strategy. I'm not too sure exactly what this is that they're mapping out. Um, they feel like they're trying something new and kind of jumping out on a limb here, but 
I feel like whatever that new plan or strategy is, unfortunately, there, there's something going on regarding time. I don't know if the time is of the essence or just the plan or, you know, their thought process about this isn't thorough enough. But something about that is bringing up some problems and issues. And I, and I kind of feel like it is regarding money, finances, maybe their business or career. I don't exactly know. Um, but there is some sort of communication or contact having, <laughs> having taking place and being had between the two of you as to, once again, management, changing some things around, shifting some things around, making positive changes. It's kind of like, what can we do without, in a sense? Um, what can we do without? But let's kind of stick the necessities here, what we need. Definitely is a connection or a friendship here between the two of you. There's a lot going on. that is um okay and there you are on top of the deck cancer so there's a strong there's a there's a strong um intent on figuring out what they want to do what they kind of feel called to do um i feel like even though the two of you have a connection and there is that conversation it's kind of like you know phoning a friend or just you know bouncing ideas off of each other or some sort um They strongly know that they need to do something, but there is this kind of reconsideration if, you know, collaborating or working with you on this or bringing you into this is exactly what they want to do. Or it's kind of like, um, is it necessary? Is it is it a need? Is it a dire need? Um, I'm not too sure what that's about. Because whatever the collaborative energy is that you and them are working on together, uh, it's not... Yeah, they, they kind of show me that there's a lot of there's so much work to be done that it's almost kind of like painful um but it has to be done one way or another it has to be done one way or another and i don't know what's going on which guys are working on but it's um they're kind of saying it's just got to be done it's just got to be done it's kind of like asking a friend for help when they don't want to um in order to kind of, you know, further, you know, have things move further along and kind of progress here. But as things are actually being done and taken care of, they're actually pretty happy with it. They're pretty happy with the outcome and the result. Um, so I don't know what the two of you are working on or like doing together, but again, they're going to be nonspecific here. It, they're definitely just kind of showing me that direction. It, it's helping guide things. It's helping direct things. Um, Which once that once that kind of clarity and that kind of light at the end of the tunnel approaches, they're saying that they actually love it. That's what's interesting. They actually love it. You know, teamwork can make the dream work. That is for sure. And this is nice because they're kind of saying, um, even though it was difficult, they're kind of, you know, making that decision of, well, they had like this intuitive hunch that it was the right thing to do afterwards. It was just kind of painful to have to do it. Um, but... There is that energy of them creating stability, whether it be with you and them business-wise, foundation-wise, or whether it just be within something for themselves. But 
again, they show up pretty happy and fulfilled and they're kind of saying they have a whole lot of new plans in mind. I don't know where this is going, but of course, if you are dealing with anyone, it kind of just leaves it there. Um, it could be dealing with an air sign, a fire sign, a water sign, or an earth sign. Goodbye.